grace as we know it, it's a work of God in Lee County where God said, I'm gonna have a place where people can come get to know me. I'm gonna have a place where people can come and, and grow in their potential as I've created them to be. And it's a place where they're gonna come and find Jesus. I've had people ask me before, you know, what's your priority for the school? Is it athletics? Is it, you know, the fine arts? Is it academics? Really, the ultimate goal above all these things is the spiritual formation through the Spirit of God and the Word of God. Now, I think it's imperative to be a school that can really be it's fulfilling the total development of the students that are enrolled. I always remind myself that kids don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. It's not just so much that they're teaching them, they're also loving them and treating them like they're their children. I teach from the perspective of how I would want someone to teach and care for my kids, not just academically, emotionally. We've got a pre-care program where you can bring them as early as 6.30. We've got an after-care program that runs all the way till 6.30 as well. Our entire campus is being put on automated fob systems covered by cameras that are monitored. We can lock down the entire campus uh, remotely. We do have a, a busing program that runs to Moore in Harnett County, and we're willing to expand that. I enjoy driving the bus, it's safe. You know, I, I have precious cargo that I'm proud to uh, take around. We're open enrollment, but cautious and selective. All parents that come through, one of the first things they do is they meet with me. I want to spend time with them. I want to get to know them. Whether they're believers or not, whether their worldview would mesh with what ours or not. As a Christian school, we get to openly express our faith and just talk with anyone about it if you have any problems. You can just really express yourself and have the freedom to believe what you want to believe here. When I came here the first day, it was just like, it felt like family. I've gotten so much closer to God this year because she's my teacher. I love my teachers. They just make coming to Grace just more fun. It's more like a place to learn and to just still have fun at the same time. We understand that lunch is one of the highlights of the student's day. There's a lot of different options parents can order in advance. I love their pizza, that's the best, and I love Mexican day. They have quesadillas sometimes, or tacos and nachos. And then you walk through the line at the computer and she just types in your order and it's all done. You get to go and eat. We want it to be as easily accessible and oftentimes even if it's not ordered in advance. So we really try to maximize that they're going to have a good time in there. They're going to get everything they need through our lunch program. We print report cards that parents can still read. We use the 10-point scale A, B, C, D, and F here. We use a phonics-driven reading model from K through up about two. Because of the smaller class size, I feel like we get to know them better. We're not just learning, but we're building relationships with each other. I've got visual learners. I've got auditory learners. I've got kids that learn better with doing things with their hands. So let's try to find a way to tap into everybody's learning style and make sure that their needs are met at the end of the day. Miss Rush, she teaches us about what we're going to use in life. Right now, we're learning about how to do checks and manage your bank account. We have music and choir and chapel, so we sing and we have fun and we dance and we laugh all the time. Look for a holistic sphere of what we have in terms of course opportunities and not just in the areas which are kind of the traditional lanes of science, English, math, and athletics. We also recognize a purpose for music, for performance arts, for all these different areas, the visual arts and so forth. There's a lot of opportunity even beyond the 8 to 3 o'clock schedule that we have for students to be able to take advantage of. We have athletics running all the way from middle school up to the varsity level at the high school level. What I like about our athletic program is that our coaches, it's not just about winning with them. They truly care about these kids and their lives and they take a vested interest in each one of them. It's not just a 3.30 to 5 o'clock position and that's what really makes us a little bit more of uh, a family. Grace is community, uh, Grace is family, Grace is a group of people who are working together to pour into these kids and, and they really care and they really want these kids to succeed. Everybody's like a family, you know, close knit. This is the only place to go in my opinion. This relationship with God, that's unique, that's different. And if you want them to get that at an early age, come Grace. We see it on our uniforms, we see it on our shirts, we see it on our lanyards. We're grace, we're here to provide grace. We're a warm place where students are loved, that they're not treated as a name on a page. They're not a problem to be managed, but they're a heart to be nurtured, they're a soul to be shepherded, and they have a potential in God's sight to be built up 
And that's what we're doing here at Grace Christian School.